Hi guys, this is a key guide for the new map Streets of Tarkov for the archive room key. For this key, you can find it in the pockets and bags of scavs, as well as in jackets or drawers. Or if you can't find it in that method, then you can go to the flea market and then you can try and buy it from there. It does usually range from about 15,000 to 40,000 rubles. And I really wouldn't spend any more than 20,000 rubles on the key anyway, just because there is only one way in or out of this building and it is an awkward place to loot. There's not a whole lot of loot inside the building and behind this locked door, there is only two sets of drawers for you to loot. So now I will show you guys on the map where to use this key. But here's a map of streets and for this key to use it we are going to be going to the building that we had to go to for population census just next to the playground and in between the post office and then the Brodeon pub and then my pmc will be starting in between the post office and the pinewood hotel all right guys so i'm here on streets and then just to my right this is where the sign is for the pinewood hotel that's a small cinema that's where the antique building is and then the post office is right here and then the playground is just right underneath this skull and crossbone signed under the sky bridge. We're going to run right towards the playground area because you cannot enter into this building unless you go in through the back. You just go in through this open fence and then the door to enter into the population census building is right here. We're going to go around all the way up the stairs and then take a right and then it's going to be your first door on the left. You just unlock this door, you go inside and then this is going to be the archive room. Inside of this room there is just two sets of drawers for you to loot. There is no loose loot that I am aware of. There is a safe however is locked and then there is no key that unlocks it at this time there's another door but you can't go into it you have to breach it so i'm not sure what key that that is and then here is the safes that you can actually lock and then really the only source of potential loot in this room so hopefully you guys found this key guide useful and it did give you an idea as to where to use the key and then what could be in it and if it would be beneficial for you to buy it thank you all so much for stopping by and watching this guide video and have a fantastic rest of your day